Are you going to vacuum properly? Yes. You're going to vacuum behind the chairs in the lounge? Yes. sitting here trying to gauge if this will work, deliberating, seeing how things feel. I really like the look of the, ta the chairs already in the space. I think it's going to look nice. Moved this couch like a little bit onto it. Oh yeah, it's always supposed to go onto it, but my only concern is like this space here because this is still obviously quite small and then if you imagine you have to put that in over there yeah. then it's going to feel like quite cramped don't you think i think it'll feel a little bit cozy <laughs> if, if, if we if we don't put it all the way and we put it just like here like move it like that amount of space is a is a decent amount of space between the two sides so this is what we've currently mapped out. We've got the like table and chairs. Could always move chairs. This back. Yeah, it's more just like just to gauge what it will look like. Obviously that guy will move to over there. And then it might be too cramped. But then my thinking is if we move that, we can get either a chair on that side, or we could get a chair and a chair. Or we could do like a little a little table situation here to hide this, this stuff. I know you were in myself. Make a fortress here. Good news. <laughs> they fixed the septic tank thing issue. So it was just mud. It wasn't. The shit. chains are filled. <laughs> 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 
What's your Christmas story? <laughs> Why do they always have something shit related for Christmas? Yeah. Well, like, at least we were not sick sick on Christmas Eve and Christmas. Let's count our blessings. We were sick on New Year's Eve. No, we were sick just before Christmas. Right. When we were in America. We just shat our lives out and vomited everywhere. Vom. Vom. Okay. You have got 17 minutes <coughs> to get ready and do your makeup. Maybe I should drive and you can do your makeup. We weren't well. sick this year. Well, we were sick, but like, <coughs> not over. Because remember, we literally made Christmas. We always, made make Chris it. we always make it for Christmas. Just for Christmas. Just at the nick of time. Okay. Like a. Lean down. Merry Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> it's a very odd angle, but I wanted to show you my outfit and also say Merry Christmas because... Oh, is that your weird 360? We're at church and we've already finished. We're about to have a swim, so I don't know we're looking at Robin because he's giving us a bell cake. We're going for a, a swim at Dalebrook, so I wanted to show you my outfit before you have to step back I go. Too. But let me... How cute! With my loafers. It's the same outfit I wore the other day. We're having a little bit of an unconventional Christmas this year because we obviously just had COVID. It looks so great. Look how nice my eyes look in this camera. In the camera? I mean, probably in person too. Because we just had COVID and... Do you want some? <laughs> Even though we actually got the negative test, it's more just like being cautious. So we have come to Dalebrook to have a little swim this is the SPF we're using the event when I did the campaign for I think it's going to be nice we planned on doing this this morning when we were sleeping we're sleeping we were supposed to wake up earlier to go to like swim somewhere that side or even this side but uh, it didn't, happen. didn't quite work out so we're doing it now Oof. <laughs> Conventional Christmas. <laughs> We're having sushi as a snack with our mimosa and drink, and then we're going to go to Sean's parents. just said to Sean I've been failing at this vlogging thing today because I'm back in my pajamas on the couch after we started the day here we are here once again we've had a long day I'll do a little catch up later maybe or even tomorrow we're having our first Christmas lunch for the day and it's what's the time like 7 7, 7 p.m. Christmas day and we're only just having our lunch so We've got, we got lunches from our parents and we're just short on the map. Mine's getting cold, so I'm not going to talk to you any longer. I'm going to have my lunch. So, I'll talk to you later. Also, FaceTime Candice, which is glorious. And it's FaceTime my sister, my mom. So, it's going to be, it's going to be a long FaceTime night. I think we're going to put on a movie and chill. It's one of the Christmas movies that Matthew and Candice did. To spend the rest of their lives searching for their other half. Uh, their I souls see a No, 
me. Thank Look. God. It's a fluffy thing on the top. It's for the mic. Oh, so that if it's windy, you can't hear the wind, you can just hear who's talking. a movie from last night because we um oh, it's just 20 to 6 boxing day and we randomly made a plan at the beach this morning to do girls drinks and we're going to winchester hotel in seapoint it's beautiful it's got bougainvillea up the sides and like black and white courtyard it's incredible i went to an event there a poetry event quite a while ago actually like a couple of years sorry i pulled some skin on my finger i'm trying to figure out if i need to cut it Always with the random bloody thoughts. I need to open this window. I closed it so that I could talk to you and not have my neighbors hear me and think that I'm insane. But um, they probably already think that, so. <sighs> very, very disjointed, but we're back at it. We're doing girls' drinks and like snacks and stuff. I am in my pajamas. I don't know why I lift my arms like a rag doll, but <laughs> in my pajamas. And I've got my face ready. I did my sort of powder look, but I thought we could pick an outfit together because I pulled some things out of my sheen bag, which I thought I wasn't going to do. I was like trying to tell myself, don't pull anything out of the bag because you want to do a haul. But to be very honest, I want to wear the things. I bought the stuff so that I could wear it now, so I'm going to bloody well wear it now. I'm not waiting and pausing life for a haul. I could do this baby, this like simple black dress from H&M, but then I have to wear that. <laughs> shapewear thing underneath and that makes me really hot and it's already quite warm it doesn't feel as warm as a breeze outside but it's cape town it's summer it's december it's warm i have a little leather mini skirt i haven't worn a mini skirt in years i'm talking high school kind of snappy though because i am of course running late this is outfit number one i don't think i'm gonna go with this one it's really fun but i feel like it needs like a night out it's fun with the little loafers the slit how cute is the skirt you obviously would have seen it in the haul i look incredible let's just all agree on that this is outfit number two and i think i'm actually just gonna go with this it's the right amount of casual and fun because i'm wearing baby kiss and heels those are h m jeans are she in top is she in as well so it's like Fun. A little bit out of my comfort zone because from the side it looks very different, but I still think it looks great and I feel very comfy. I am sweating. Can you tell? You can definitely tell. Final little outfits and I think it's really cute. I'm very, very happy. giant mirror I found on Facebook marketplace and apparently it's really heavy as well as the delivery guy I have a guy who helps me deliver some stuff I actually say it like I've had him for a while I recently found this guy because he delivered the chest of drawers in our room and then he's helped me deliver this mirror he's also getting a table but look how glorious it looks it's really nice with the black as well and it's really big I'm not 100% certain on the placement just yet and it looks nice next to my railing but obviously then I need to clear up all of all of this which is the plan for these holidays but then we just show you my giant mirror and I got it for like literally a thousand right and the lady had it on for more and I negotiated because it's what my dad told me to do so I did it. Mirrors that are more like this size or even smaller than this usually go for like 2,000, 3,000 a lot more. This has no trips or issues or anything like that so in perfect condition I just need to give it a clean but i'm very happy yay so it's a little bit later now i'm heading out for lunch with alex but this is my base outfit in my new mirror the sheen jeans my kind of black ribbed tank from witchery sheen bag how cute shoes are my superbless loafers and the bucket hat is actually from a pr drop from Squin. And the sunglasses are cotton on. I think it's cute and fun, a little bit summery, but still warm because it's gloomy outside. Let me show you. 
Look at that weather. Gloom, gloom, gloom. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> See, this Welcome is Alex. to my channel. <laughs> this is great. Yeah. Oh, it's always stunning. a vlog. Always oh, a vlog. A, oh, I love the vlogs. I know. Subscribe, like, comment. <laughs> You're great at this. this and said it's very me yes. and I agree I feel like it looks different color wise on here but it's so beautiful I want it I haven't mentioned this on the vlog today because oh, morning it's uh, Tuesday it's early well not that early anymore it's quarter to ten I am getting a tattoo today well a couple of tattoos today I'm so excited Basically the goal today is to fill up this arm a little bit more up here because it looks disjointed right now and I'm ready to have a sleeve, so let's do it. just quickly show you what the dining room is looking like before our table gets delivered. I mapped out where the table will go, what the chairs will look like. It might all shift over a little bit so there's more room here to walk through but also still enough room on the back but that's what it's looking like and then this is what it looks like with the table. How beautiful! Does it look? I didn't even envision the metal and then the metal of the legs, but it works so well. If you're hearing that sound, it's from my tattoo. How beautiful. And then I have plans to do some things on this wall, which I think will draw it in really nicely and not be too much. I have an attention grab, because I think this is so beautiful as a, a combination. And it works out really well with the chairs and having enough space for each person. We still need to get a rug. This is also off our Facebook Marketplace basically just cement plinths they're not filled so they're still heavy but they're kind of hollow in the center and then a kind of smoky glass top I don't love that that's blue so I need to change that but I think it's just like double-sided tape that doesn't have the backing taken off so that there's something between the plinth and the glass but I love what's happening here I think it looks really good it's a nice focal point without being too much focus and it gives Sean the ability to kind of play around with his plants and have them on show and then once we have the gallery wall up here which I'm getting the command strips for this week then I think it will feel a little bit more complete well generally having anything on the walls will make it feel more complete because the furniture I feel like is basically done
back in the messy office. I'm going out for not breakfast, like a coffee with my mom, and I want to find an olive tree. And she told me there was a place that she found it. I will vlog it so you guys can see if you want to get one as well. And I feel like gorgeous, gorgeous girls need to be wearing wide leg jeans. Not wearing any makeup besides eyebrows because the eyebrows are necessary, but I need to give my skin just a break from wearing makeup at all. I've got these two babies. Well, there's a third that I've just spotted now. I had to give myself a little talking to when I was putting together this outfit because I initially put on this and then I was like, oh, I can't have like, you know, stomach from the side out and I can't have this so much tummy and the arms and whatever, whatever. And then I put on a t-shirt with sleeves and I was like, oh, why am I being this person? Why am I being this person about wearing a simple item of clothing? It shouldn't bother me. So once again, forcing myself to wear something that makes me feel slightly uncomfortable, but I love the way it looks with the new tattoos. The babies are looking great. I'm excited to get some more. I've looked at it from the side. You can see both of them. Well, you can see, no, you can see the, the top two. I'm excited to get some more, like, like around there. There. <laughs> I can't show you with pointing at the camera. I have got this baby on today. Must not forget a mask. Jersey, present for mom, keys, and then let's go. I've come to this nursery with mom because um, I wanted to find an olive tree and she's actually already found me one so <laughs> I hid it away. She hid it for me. <laughs> yeah. Where is it? Oh she really did hide it. Oh there's two in this. There's a couple more there. Those are all olives. Hey? Yeah but this one has this one has olives on it. I don't care about the olives mom. I just want the tree. It's I want to see them. I want the, the bushiest one that I can get. So this one looks that one long. looks a little bit sad though, like sparse. Are they all sparse? Yeah, that one looks a bit better there. This one here. See there? How must I get in there? I don't know. Why do they all look like they have like one little little twig branch? Well, this is the so one. Much. This is the one. No, mom, other way. That way. This <laughs> is the one. <laughs> it's turning you sideways. How great is this? It's almost my height. It is. <laughs> And I was like, this is a short little thing. <laughs> he's gonna get this, eh? He said he's gonna get a trolley. Is he? I'm gonna find a pot. That's too small. Oh god. What about that tall one? I feel like carting that up the st stairs, Sean's gonna no, but kill a, me a considering plastic, like... A plastic, a plastic tall one, maybe? Yeah, maybe. We found this one too, but my question to mom was, is it too tall? Yeah, you take that. Look at this one compared to me. What do you guys think? Too Is it too tall? tall? Will it fit in her apartment? Come down. She definitely cannot <laughs> carry it up the uh, stairs. I think Sean would kill me if I made him <laughs> carry this upstairs because I made him carry furniture. I place. would want to be a fly on the wall in that conversation. But these are wild olive trees. What's the difference? And these are these actually look really nice. And they're cheaper. I wonder what the what that one doesn't even have a like label thing on it. Mm. So which should it be? I that one? I cannot take this tree though. Or that big tall one. We can't take the big tall one and it's leaning like all hell. We could take that. But one. the small one looks good. But that looks isn't that too small? Oh it's got this little bit up here. What is this place? Look at all the pretty flowers. I'm so bright and happy. And all the different shades. That's a nice RV. Mm. Look at all this color, glorious color. <laughs>
I wanted to show you what we got at the market last night. First of all, this box of delicious cherries. I'm so excited about these, love them. And then I also had them for breakfast with one of these guys and a mince pie. And then, oh my gosh, something we always get at the market, like a must besides flowers, is pasties. These are absolutely incredible. I already had one for breakfast. And then the final thing we got was flowers. I always like to get a couple bunches when I'm at the market just because I feel like it brings some life into the apartment besides the, the actual green plants that we have. And I'm very excited about our new table, so I wanted to put some flowers in my favorite vase, this one from Country Road. But also while we're here, look how beautiful this paper is. <gasps> I think it's just so pretty with the bird and all the flowers. They've done such a great job with it. Like this is something you want to take a photo of. There's even a little bee over there. How cute. It's just so, so beautiful. Oh, love it. Very summery. some alcohol because it's um new year's eve it's like 10 right and 9 30 very early i've just put on a little put on the shorts from shein and my cotton on little slides woolies big tea and then that's actually the name of it and then my best cap and cotton on sunglasses and spf so that we can just take a walk down the road you sure you want to Lift your case of castle light all the way home. City of mine, how I love, how I love the city of mine. It never gets me down. City of mine, how I love, how I love the city of mine. It never gets me down. Born in the city, I was raised on its edges. My pop work is life when it's gone. Blocks up on love in its center. If I could live here forever, think it'd be for the better. I love the weather, even though it's fog 24 7. I love the people. This is city. I met all my best friends, and I want to thank every break. We're at New Year's Eve. I haven't actually said anything for today, but we're doing for my tattoos. We're putting a condom on my arm. <laughs>
We made our perfect New Year's breakfast, but it's basically lunch. Croissants, scrambled eggs, basil pesto mushrooms, bacon, and Sean making a noise as usual. How lekker does that look, man? cream so I thought I would just show you guys that I'm in that itchy scabbing phase of the tattoo you can never really get that side but it's definitely scabbing down the bottom there and it's itchy but it's not too bad because this is super light how pretty the bee is looking I just put some cream on it I'm using the panthen on this one I can just put in my handbag because it's nice and small it helps with the itching and I do it every four hours but it's looking so pretty i mean look at that detail there you can see the scabbing it's not too much it's really not that bad like compared to my other tattoos this is really easy